The globe is an exact but a very small replica of the earth. It shows us the size, shape and exact location of continents and countries, oceans and seas on the earth. Often, maps make a better option to study the earth as these are easier to carry and also give us very accurate information of a place. Just imagine how difficult it will be if we have to carry around a globe with us to find the way to our destination. Maps a map is a drawing of a part or the whole of the earth on a flat surface. This could be on a sheet of paper, a board or a wall. The bigger the size of the map, the more details about that geographical area it can cover. An atlas is a book containing several maps. Different types of maps Political maps Political maps show boundaries of the countries and states and the important cities. Physical maps Physical maps show natural features of the earth such as mountains, plains, plateaus, lakes, rivers and so on. Thematic maps Thematic maps show a specific theme or topic related to an area such as kind of soil, rainfall, climate, mineral deposits, natural vegetation, crops, industries, places of tourist interest, etc. The thematic map shown here shows the climatic regions in India. Directions We know that East, West, North and South are the four main directions. Most maps show the North at the top. Once the position of North is known, it is much easier to identify the other directions. South is directly opposite to north. Also, when we are facing the north, west is to our left side and east is to our right side. The subdirections between west and north, subdirection northwest, north and east, northeast. South and East, Southeast, South and West, Southwest. Scales A map is a smaller version of a place, and distances have to be shrunk in order to fit on the limited space available. Therefore, the distance between two places is identified by a scale. This helps to understand the actual distance between them. Statement form Some maps express a scale in a statement form. If the scale of a map is set at 1 cm for every 10 km, it means that every centimeter on the map 
represents 10 kilometers on actual ground. Graphic scale or linear scale. When the scale is not given in a statement form but instead is in the form of a line divided at regular intervals, it is called a graphical or linear scale. Symbols In maps, symbols are meant to provide information about the geographical location of places like temples, churches, bridges or roads, etc. Some map symbols are given below. Colors The colors used in maps depict the following features. Red Major roads Blue Water bodies such as rivers, lakes, waterfalls, etc. Green Forested areas and vegetation. White Used to show icy or polar regions or areas that receive snowfall. Brown Contour lines and elevations. Black Minor roads, trails, structures, latitude and longitude lines, etc. Legend A legend or a key is the list of symbols used in the map placed in a box next to the map 